Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is another uh, demonstration of Google Blockly uh, using uh, using Google Blockly to create code uh, as code generator. This is an array that I created over here, and this is a um, uh, this is just a very basic um, counting game in Python. Actually, that's where it's going to go. So I want to show you that uh, you can change the re you can rename the variables, which I thought was kind of cool. Cool. So you can rename the variables, and all of the variables have that apply there automatically get updated, which is very nice. Uh, let's rename that variable back to number. It's creative. And when we actually that's curious. It's got double quotes here, but when it goes out, it comes out as single quotes. So that's I'd say that's a bug. <clears throat> UI bug. So I've got the uh, Python here. We're going to go ahead and test it. Very s simple, silly. And I go to the Code Academy Python, and there it is. If I run it, it uh, does exactly what it's supposed to do. You did not type a 7. So if I change this, run it, I typed a 7. Ooh, that's so exciting. No, not really. But um, what it does mean is that I am generating code from pretty pictures. So uh, thanks out, thanks big thanks go out to uh, R. Weiss at Code Academy for his uh, Python lessons. Really uh, enjoyed that. Thanks out to uh, Google Block Lead developer as well. And thank you for your time and happy computing.